Welcome citizens to 3.23 again. We are testing today this ship behind me, Anvil FAT Lightning. Now this ship has profited from the master modes very nicely. Now instead of only two size three, we have four size three and four size two. In total eight weapons as before, but DPS is much increased. Now if you didn't know, the weapons have now different DPS. For example, M7A Canyons for the Corsair have lower ammo count, but it is much bigger DPS and some other Canyons have same DPS as before, so that is really nice. What kind of bug is that? Now this new build is much more stable, but there are still bugs obviously, you see like that. I have put on this ship four size 2 mass drive cannons and four size 3 dead bolts. Let's see how powerful this ship is right now. We are going out nice and easy. Landing gear up. You have to put the landing gear up, otherwise you can only fly 30 meters per second. Next thing, if you are flying in a weapons mode you will have only 205 kilometers. You can boost until 400 meters per second at kilometers. And then when you turn the quantum drive on, then that is your flight speed and you can fly fast. Now, since I don't have enemies, I have taken the first tracking training permit certificate. As you can see, when the quantum drive is turned on, shield is shutting down. Okay. Now this new build is very heavy on GPU. I have turned everything max and the clouds on reference mode. I have only 30 FPS when static. Let's see how much FPS can I gain if I turn down the reference to high. There is no difference. Okay, 4 FPS, 5. Okay, there's a difference, but not too much. Okay, let's go to our mission. Now what I like about new quantum drive is you do not have to turn it off and on to get the position. It is always ready to fly, which is really great. Server recovery report zero, replication layer enabled true. Oh, nice. That's nice to see. Even though the server FPS is around four, I was in a server with 15 FPS. It, everything was so smooth, amazing, but <laughs> Some bug happened and I couldn't move my vehicle, so yeah, I had to go in another server. Four size 3 deadbolts and they are on Kimbled, which is even better. So this ship really profited from the new update and master modes. Imagine when this ship get a military upgrade, if it gets the military upgrade. Wow, that would be something. Why can't I fly faster right now? As soon as you spool, then you can fly above SEM speed. Otherwise, you are slow. What I don't like about this master modes is it will take you more time to finish the mission. Because when you quantum drive, let's say you can quantum directly to this position, you will be landed 30 kilometers from it. Now, you can fly underneath the SE speed and have 200 meters per second. That's it. You need like five minutes to fly there. But if you turn on the quantum drive and fly there to the position, you will do it faster. But then you have another problem. And another problem is you do not have a shields. So if you are flying too fast right now and you want to break, just turn off the quantum drive, you will stop immediately. Which, is, which can be useful, of course. Okay, do I have a gimbals on? Now the gimbal mode is on. Okay, Mr. Paddington. I hope it's not the bear Paddington. <laughs> there he is. He has a friend though. Let's see how this works. And I cannot fire anything. Why cannot I fire my weapons? They oh they they can fire. Of course they can. Why wouldn't they? 
The server has to work for them, not for me. And this is the problem right now. You engage in the fight and you cannot escape. Well, you can, but you are risking to fight without a shield. And look, I cannot fire anything. Damn. Maybe to turn on, turn off now. I'm losing my shield while they are firing on me. But they are slow, they cannot catch me. So this is good. You are covered a little bit while you are escaping. Okay, nice. Now you can escape. It's easier now to escape the fight than before. Okay, now it's working. We are ready. The server is... wow. Amazing. Not... The ballistic do not go through the shield anymore. That's a good thing. Everything becomes now... Oh! But still this is powerful. Wow. Nomad. I just went through him. Oh, the desync is real. But at least we can do something. Gimbal. Come on, dude. Stay in one place. A few moments later. Finally, after flying around like crazy. This shows nothing, guys. I can't test this with a server like this. Yeah, it's just simply not possible. What I can see from this master mode that this ship has profited a lot. Also, what I like, the ships now you cannot be easily killed because the weapons do not go through the shield anymore, which is kind of nice. But this new build is real amazing when the FPS is good. Look how everything is detailed and nice. They improve the graphics a lot and that is why everything stutters. But the game is still not optimized well, so we have a lot of unused GPU and CPU potential. Right now, at, for my computer, like there is only usage of 60% of my GPU, losing over 40% of FPS. So imagine if my GPU and CPU were fully utilized. Okay, server error. Now we have dead server. Let's see, will the server recover? Let's wait. A few moments later. Two minutes and we are recovered. And look at the server FPS. Oh my God, 30. Now we can test everything. Let's find a new mission. Oh, this, this was welcome. Thank you. CH. Oh, the server FPS is going down rapidly. Okay, we have to wait a little bit for the contracts to appear. Now, there is no more contracts personal. Now you have verified and unverified. Never mind the contract. While we wait, let's try the EVA. The new EVA. All right. Ooh, look how I'm flying. I see in the contract. Look. Turn around. Ooh. Buff. I've hit the ship. Okay. This is a good view. Back, side, up, front. All good, all good. Ooh, look at the turning. So smooth. Yeah, really like it. Changing the way. Let's see if I can grab the hands. My sh oh, look, she's grabbing the ship and pushing herself. Nice. Rotate. This is really cool, guys. When you rotate the camera, look at this. 
real amazing. There's a lot of stuttering here for some reason. From the first person view. Nice. If I had a ship with interior, I would test entering this ship. But let's try it here. Oh, no. Okay, I'm inside. I mean, this new patch improved the game so much. Imagine when this is ironed and polished out. Wow, that will be amazing. Wow, 4K, everything high and very high is amazing. Look at the level of details. This new star engine is amazing. Look at the Tamar surface, the craters and everything. Yeah, love it. Server FPS is 5, okay. Maybe this time we will have more luck. Nice. Look at this view. Guys, this is truly amazing. I love the new graphics so much. They improved already amazing graphics to this. I'm coming in easy. Oh, look at that. We can upgrade our ship there. Nice. Restock at least. Kimball. Damn it. We cannot test anything. And I cannot compare my ship to anything else. This is really bad. Okay, he's dead. Okay, let's see if we can restock. Oh yeah, we can do. We do not have any damage, that's good. Because the ballistics are not going through the shield anymore. Finally, that was the thing that really annoyed me. Alright, my fellow citizens, this was it. Amulet of Fitzy Lightning is powerful. How powerful? We cannot measure right now. The servers are really packed and you cannot have a, a decent combat to see how the good ships really are. I think the FHC profited from these new master modes and I like the design. Oh, what was that? Player or a pirate? I don't know. But still, there's a lot way to go. Thank you for watching Star Citizens and until next video, have fun out there.